Welcome to Renaissance English Tuition IELTS Guide. This cue card was recently asked in an IELTS exam. It can be answered in various ways. This is one of them. The word insect in itself is very terrifying for most of the people. People think that the insects are very precarious and ugly looking creatures. But, not all the insects are dangerous and repelling, some are very beautiful and harmless. Lady Bird, which is my favorite, is one of them. In North America, they call them lady bugs. Entomologists, however, prefer to call them beetles as they cannot be classified as true bugs. I think they are nearly ubiquitous as they can be found in Europe, the United States of America and Asia. Their natural habitats are forests, grasslands, and even cities. They can be easily found under rocks and rotting logs of wood. I have seen some in my garden also. Their body shape can vary from round to elliptical. Their small black heads have two tiny antennae. They have six legs. The body is protected with hard, dome-shaped wing covers. Some species have red, orange or yellow wing covers with black spots. Others can have golden stripes on black wing covers, and some can be without any markings. I like them because of their vibrant colors and diverse patterns. The most significant fact about them is that they are harmless to human beings. Besides being harmless to man, they are very useful to farmers as they feed on aphids and other agricultural pests. I have read somewhere that a single ladybird can devour up to 5,000 insects in its total lifespan. However, a few species can be harmful to crops. When in danger, they secrete a foul-tasting oily fluid from the joints of their legs to protect themselves from the predators. In addition to these facts about them, many legends and myths surround them. They are considered auspicious in many cultures. In India also children treat them as good luck charms. They think spotting them in their surroundings is good for getting good marks in studies. Just because of this reason I used to search for them near exams in school days, and they were a kind of magical fairy tale characters for me. I thought they could grant people their wishes. They were the protagonists of my reverie world, which gave my imagination the wings to ride on to a different world of dreams and fantasy. That's all for today. You can omit or add some details according to your cue card and time limit. Thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to like share comment and subscribe. Hit the bell icon for notifications. See the description to follow us.